My name is Dina Peters and I work for a Fortune 500 grocer where I'm the pricing manager for produce and floral. The issue that we were having was that all of the products in the store get automatically price checked from a third party. They can't do that with fresh product. So what we do is we have 23 markets where employees from stores go out to collect this competitive price check information. The information that was coming back from the store personnel was incomplete, inaccurate, and a lot of times we had to hunt it down because they actually didn't turn it in at the deadline. We were taking produce personnel out of the department. Produce, more than anywhere else in the store, needs service for the customer. I was invited to a innovative workshop, and what I really, really enjoyed was I had never been in a workshop before that made me do things during the workshop. So one of the things that we were told to do during the lab was to actually go out and see for yourself. What I didn't realize is that I learned a tremendous amount by watching for myself. Um, I actually booked time with the field merchandiser and met him at a competitor and we went to go and collect the price checks. He wanted to get out of there as fast as possible. So that again was going to create some pricing accuracy issues. I didn't realize how long the process took. On a good check, it took about two hours and on a not so good check, it could take upwards to four or five hours. So that was 400 plus hours that the produce employees were away from the customer being able to service and help them find what they needed. We went out to a competitor and I was able to watch how they collected the price check data in one of their handheld systems. So we took one market out of the 23 markets and we tested it on a weekly basis to collect all fresh produce and we were able to roll it out into all of the markets. And what that did for my team was it completely flipped. And ultimately, this company is more competitive because of this team's great work. Obviously, the best part of this whole experience is that there are now 400 hours a month put back into the store to service the produce customer. So we were able to put $144,000 of service back into the produce department. And I know what you're thinking, well how much did that cost you? But it didn't cost us anything. In fact, we saved $10,000 a month net.